Hey guys, how you doing? Jack Scalfani here, Cooking with Jack show, and I have Lainey from Simply Bakings. Thank you for coming on the show. Thank you for inviting me. I so appreciate it, because I don't know what I'm doing. And she's going to uh, teach me Tehran. Is it Tehran? Mm-hmm, Tehran. Yeah, it's a uh, banana dessert, right? Yes. Awesome. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get out of her way. She's awesome. If you haven't checked her channel out, we'll put a link at the end of this episode so you can jump over to Simply Bakings. Oh my goodness, you've got to see the stuff she makes. I was so excited to get her on the show. So let's give her the stage. I'm going to be her assistant today. And uh, be nice. Show her some love, okay? <laughs> this is an awesome dish. So the first thing you're going to get is the spring roll wrappers. You can actually use pastry wrappers, and it's best to get them at the Asian market because the consistency is actually pretty different from the grocery stores. The next thing you're going to get is jackfruit, which you can get at the Asian markets as well. Now, there's different kinds of jackfruit. This is the I guess you can call it the adult jackfruit, and that is what you need because it's fully grown. You're not going to want the young jackfruit. Then you're going to get these bananas, burro bananas. You can actually find these at the Asian market or uh, Mexican markets. They will have them there, and you want burro bananas. It looks like this, and the more black they are, the more sweeter it is. Then you're going to get the brown sugar, and you're going to want light brown sugar because this is actually the regular brown sugar that you want. So you're going to cut your bananas into three slices. Then you're going to cut your jackfruit. I like to cut it thin, but you can cut it to whatever size you like. And then you're just going to place your sugar in a bowl. So what I like to do is grab the brown sugar and just put it in a large bowl. Then I'm going to grab the bananas and then put them in here and just coat it just like that. Okay, so usually when you buy the spring rolls, you're going to buy it frozen, so you're going to want to defrost it about 30 minutes prior to cooking it. And it's really thin, so you, you need to, or uh, when we're moving it, you need to carefully do it, because you can tear it, and then there goes your spring roll wrapper. So, do it really carefully, like so. That takes a while, but there you go. Look at that, look how thin it is. So the first thing you're going to do is grab your banana, you're gonna place it semi, like right here in the middle, and then you're gonna grab your jackfruit. I like to put two pieces of jackfruit in there, I like the taste of it, and then you're going to roll it. So you're gonna take the bottom piece and just do this, roll it once, grab the ends, there you go, and then you're going to continue rolling. Grab the water, the water is like a paste. So then rub it on the spring roll and there you have it. So here are the taron. I just rolled it up and then now we're going to fry it. Make sure your oil is hot enough. Oh, perfect. So I'm just putting the turon in here and this is perfect. You want the oil to bubble like that and when it does, it's probably take two minutes to cook on one side and then two minutes on the other side. But what I like to do is I like to check. We're almost there. See, that's a really good color. We just want a little bit darker. Jack here is placing the turon on paper towels on a plate so the paper towels can soak up the oil. Okay, I'm about ready to dive on these already. I, do we, how long do I have to wait? Because these smell amazing. Um, you can try it now, but it's going to burn your tongue. <laughs> I've done it before. I don't mind. So what we're doing is we're adding a little more brown sugar to the outside? Yes. And this is done natu This is done if you like. If you want. It's beautiful. Yep. Looks good. So we're good. All right, now I'm just, I'm ready to try it. Is it, is it ready? It's ready. Let's do it. All right, which one are you going for? This one. That one? Why did you pick the smallest one? Because... No, I'm not going to pick... <laughs> you can pick I'll that pick one. the smallest one. Everybody complains I eat too much. You pick a different one. Okay. I'll pick... Ah, it's so freaking warm. Yeah, it's really hot. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to say freaking. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, you try it. All right. No, you try one with me. Okay. It's still a little warm. Is this too warm for you? Uh-oh, it's stuck. Go with that one. Go with that one over there. That one right there. Oh, wow, that's perfect. That's better. <gasps> These are beautiful. Okay. Ready? Okay, yeah, I'm Oops. ready. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. Okay, cool. Mmm, my favorite. Mmm. Wow. What do you think? That's amazing. It's like 
I feel like a donut. <laughs> Tastes like a donut. Really? Banana filled donut. It's amazing. Oh my gosh. Woo. <laughs> Sugar rush. <laughs> this is so awesome. It's called Tehran. Check out the recipe down below. Go over to Simply Bakings right now. The link's on the screen. There you go. Click on it and subscribe to her. This is awesome. We'll see you on the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye.